and yet another binding tutorial for everyone uh, this time focusing on the 5888 coaxial four channel helicopter um, the 5888 and the 9958 remotes are both compatible you can bind uh, bind one to the other and vice versa so it stands to reason that the 5888 would also bind with the more professional uh, larger Turnigy 9x remote what the benefit would be there would be if you have the 5888 and the 9958 you could store both those models in here as we can store up to eight or nine in the stock Trinity 9x I think actually up to 16 once you start installing custom firmware but anyway you could have your 5888 in here with its trims all programmed and then you can switch over to the 9958 uh, one or two of your own 9958s with different trim and it's just uh, a seamless integration I'll start with binding here so the same procedure as you followed for the 9958 we're going to be wanting to press this trip this bind button on the back and then turn on the radio and I'll show you that right now so just hold in the bind button turn on the radio radio turns on put it to the ground here take this turn on the helicopter now I didn't find the helicopter actually did anything different in terms of the LED flashing at all so I just leave it for a bit maybe leave it for five seconds or so and then we'll turn off the helicopter put it down here turn off your remote turn back on the transmitter turn on the 5888 helicopter let it do its thing and uh, there we go we are bound to the 5888 uh, as a side note my 5888 is out of commission one of the servos is dead but you can see that uh, everything works just fine here so you've got another option for the 5888 as well as giving you more options in terms of moving up to more hobby grade features such as having multiple models on a more professional remote thank you